Backstage is an angry father named William. You see, William has been waiting a year and a half to come face to face with a 20-year-old man named Jaquan. Now, you see, William doesn't want to fight Jaquan. He doesn't want to hurt him in any way. He just wants to tell him two words, man up. Yeah. So, everybody, welcome Will's 18-year-old daughter, Madison, to The Maury Show. Yeah. Now, Madison has a nine-month-old son named Elijah. Look at him. And not only does Jaquan deny he's Elijah's father, he has blocked Madison from all forms of communication. Whoa. You look at him, you get angry. Why? I do, Maury, because I have a nine-month-old son, and he's just, he needs a dad, you know? It's just, it's not fair. Look at him. So, hey, look so at he him. has a lot of doubts, so why are you sure he's the father? Look at him. Here's the thing. Apparently, the way I read it, you were going through a bad time. You were very close to your grandfather, and he died. Right? I was, yeah, Maury. My grandpa died, and I was just going through stuff. I was drinking all... alcohol every night, you right. know, partying. Right, also because you broke up with a boyfriend, right? Yeah, I got my heart broken. And, and then all of a sudden... Then my grandpa died, and just downhill and, from there, you and know? And then you meet Jaquan on, online, right? Yeah, I met him on Facebook. And you think that you have a timeline. I do. It is exactly when, whoa, what is oh, all this? Are you ready? All right, conception date. This is my conception date, March 18th, right? Okay, I was 10 weeks pregnant at my first ultrasound, and from March 18th to May 23rd, that's exactly 10 weeks right there, okay? This day that the doctors gave me the conception date, I was with him that day. And then my ultrasound, 10 weeks. Exactly 10 weeks. And then my second ultrasound, exactly 26 weeks from that date. And he was born December 21st. You're going to tell me? So you find out you're pregnant. You had to quit school. I did, yes. You never were able to go back. You had to get a GED on your own. I dropped out of school because I had hypermesis gravidarum, which is extreme morning sickness, so I could not go to school. I had to stay in my room all day with the lights off because even the lights made me sick. I was going to go to school to be an RN and then work on CNA and then be an LPN and then get my pediatric anesthesiology license. But... <laughs> Now, it's, it's very interesting, Madison, because usually, if we have a woman here who's accusing a guy of being the father of the child and the guy's not stepping up or anything else, we'll have a sister, we might have a mother. Right. Rarely, if ever, do we have a father. Your father is here. And, and he's living over this situation. Because what, your father, who's the grandfather, has to be the father of this child now. Right, he's bought me diapers and wipes because I can't work. <laughs> um, I'm breastfeeding, I breastfeed my baby and I can't work because I can't leave him with anybody. He doesn't take a bottle. Um, it's just been rough, you know. Here's the thing, here's the thing. On, on Jaquan's side, okay, he says, he didn't even know you were pregnant until you were five months pregnant. And that's true. That, and he read uh, that true. on Facebook. That's true, and he's he's right. That's true. He didn't Why? know I was Why? pregnant because I didn't tell him. Right. I know I was wrong for that. I was, and I admit that. Meanwhile, your father, your father has never met Jaquan, right? No. He They're going to meet here for the first time. They are. So we might as well bring. We're going to bring your father out in a bit, but first, here's Jaquan. Jaquan, come on out. That's not your baby. Yeah. Yeah. Really? That's your baby. The nose, the head, the big ass forehead. <laughs> let's hear let's hear Jaquan's side of it. I don't think we he's he look white. He don't look white. <laughs> Why'd you have a block? If I was the father, she would have been told me like when it first happened. Okay. How about that timeline she made? Do you remember she that? She could be making that up. I don't know. She making that up? Okay. That's made up. How, how do I got all the dates? I sat there forever. 
ever scrolling through our messages just to get that thing. Laquan, you have any other kids? No, I don't. You don't? If you're the father, would you step up and be the father? I'm supposed to, yeah. I will. You got to, what you mean? Everybody, here's William. Good to see you. Good to see you. Nice to finally meet you. There you go. All right. Do you have a dad active in your life, brother? Not really. That little boy? He needs one. I trust her explicitly, bro. If she says what she says, then either you're the father or we got another story about immaculate conception, bro. All right? William. You're not just missing out on that boy, but a great woman, too. So I don't, I don't know if you two can be together, because from what I understand, you know, and from what I see, when we can all change, but you kind of act, you're acting like a kid still. It's time to grow up. It's time to man up. Okay? Her mom and I spent a lot of time raising her, and she came out real good. We weren't perfect. We made our fair share of mistakes, believe Amen. that. But I've looked into Elijah's face for so many hours, bro, that when I look into yours, I don't have any doubt on that, on that paper right there. All right? Look at this, Lori. Now, you said you don't have a father in your life. I don't. OK, well, you do now. Aww. I'm be that guy, because I already know we're family, bro. I already know. You might have your doubts, but I don't have mine. William, nice to see you. Thank like you. this way. All right, now. I've been looking forward to doing that for such a long time. I know. I can't believe this is our first meeting. Right. And you would welcome him into your family? Absolutely, as long as she does. Right. But whether she's going to be with him or not, it doesn't, it doesn't matter whether it's intimate or not. If he's the father of this child, he's part of the family. That's right. Maury, <laughs> when I found out her mom was pregnant with my son, I didn't ask any questions. Um, when he was born, he was my son and got my name. Same thing with her, I never questioned it. And if a DNA test said that they weren't mine, they're still mine. You know what I mean? Can you understand where Jaquan's coming from or you just can't see it at all? I mean, I understand where he's coming from, especially with her not telling him. Right. I was which, wrong for that, yeah, I admit that. I just learned a lot while I was back there. You know, there's, I don't dig deep into her business. Right. Um, I just take care of I take care of them. But how could I tell him if he had me blocked on all social media? Okay. Right. That's the past. We're here now in the present. Mm -hmm. Elijah deserves a father, whoever it might be. And you all are hoping it's Jaquan. Right now it's me. Right. <laughs> and Jaquan, you have said, if you're the father, you'll step, step up. up. That's true. Yeah. In the case of nine-month-old Elijah, Jaquan, you are not. <laughs> really? What to say? No. What to say? Look, I don't know what. I, I don't know who. There's no possibility for that to be nobody else's baby, bro. Wow. No. What do I say? Listen, right. I don't understand. But There's like not I just said, two months, two months difference to be in somebody else's baby, but my son was born at full term. It doesn't make sense. And why are you looking at me like that? You know what? I'm at a loss for words. So am I because it's two months difference. I don't understand how that even makes sense. So apparently you made a mistake. I don't understand this. You said you were drinking and partying. Okay. So I guess that's true. So that's how you said you were with him. That must be what happened with someone else. I'm disappointed. Obviously, I'm not so angry. 
I still have a beautiful grandson, okay? Thanks for watching this dramatic DNA reveal. If you want to see more paternity stories, click here. And be sure to subscribe to be the first to know about all new DNA drama.